Roblox's video game platform lets you create customizable avatars, play user-created games, and make friends online. Though wildly popular, Roblox has also been criticized for making it too easy for kids to buy Robux. That's the virtual currency used inside the game. And for exposing young users to graphic images, vulgar language, and other material that's just not suited for children. Now a group of parents is taking on the gaming giant in a class action lawsuit that was filed right here in San Diego. Okay, let's steal this money. She not only lost, you know, some confidence and, and trust uh, in the world through this, but, you know, she lost what she thought was a best friend. Damien Ohl says his daughter started playing Roblox when she was just six years old. Just monitored and, you know, it seemed like every kid was on it. So, um, you know, we thought it was a safe space for her to enjoy playing video games. At age 10, Damien says his daughter had met a friend on Roblox. She made a, a close friend online. Um, that we presumed was around her age and um, was led to believe that she was about that age. They were wrong. It turned out that the online friend was actually an adult predator. I went into some of it and just looked and there was just some inappropriate conversations that, that happened and, um, you know, uh, it was just shocking for me. I myself am a mother. Alexandra Walsh, one of the attorneys representing all and the other plaintiff says Roblox's millions of users and their parents think it's safe. Hang on. As it turns out, Roblox, it's the Wild West. It is unregulated, inappropriately monitored, um, and it needs to change. According to the court filing, Roblox previously addressed safety concerns in its 2020 SEC filing saying, while we devote considerable resources to prevent this from occurring, we are unable to prevent all such interactions from taking place. But inappropriate interactions aren't the only reason Damien and his fellow plaintiffs decided to file suit. The lawsuit states in part, parents do not realize that once in the game, players can buy in-app currency that can be used to purchase a vast range of items for their avatar from third-party apps. These vary widely in cost from a sword that could only cost a dollar to a hat that could cost $600. Both sides will have a chance to present their case in the federal court in coming months. Let's find the money. One thing about Roblox is it's really difficult to navigate and to access any information on there. Uh, what happens in these live chat rooms on these games, it, it, it disappears. When you log out of that, it's gone. Roblox responded to CBS 8's request for comment by saying they dispute the allegations and said in part, Roblox's expert team of thousands of people dedicated to moderation and safety, they act swiftly to block inappropriate content. There are a number of features to keep kids safe, including filtering text chat to block inappropriate content, offering parental controls and giving parents visibility into their children's activity, including preventing them from making unauthorized purchases. You can read their full statement on our website, cbs8.com. Kirsten Holmes, CBS 8.